DiCaprio, along with 10 billionaires, have invested in a startup that can produce hundreds of real diamonds in just a few weeks, producing what they call ethically and morally pure diamonds. The founder and the CEO of Diamond Foundry, Martin Rush Eisen, is with me now. Martin, thanks for coming in and bringing the stones. You're welcome. So what made you want to do this? Of all the projects out there. Our team worked uh, 10 years on uh, solar power technology. We were one of, one of the first companies in Silicon Valley to really go for solar power technology innovation. Uh, $500 million later, uh, we couldn't quite make that a commercial success uh, due to various factors, but uh, our team decided we have uh, certain engineering capabilities and we can, can apply that to other industries as well. And so we, we picked a very high value, uh, a very high value material that's 500 times as valuable as gold, we figured it would be hard to make gold. So out of curiosity, did you pitch to Leonardo DiCaprio or did he somehow learn about your startup and ask to invest? We've been completely in stealth mode until last week, uh, but through the grapevine, his uh, team learned about us and uh, so pinged us. Okay, so for many people, this is the answer, because after that movie, there were a lot of people who said, we don't want diamonds anymore as gifts because many children lose their lives in this, local populations and the earth are exploited. But do you worry about the marketing factor that somehow people look at these and say they're not real? Well, this is really based on a new technology. It's a te it's, it starts with a natural uh, diamond extracted from the earth, and we take a slice of that and add atomic layer by atomic layer on top of that natural diamond and kind of extend the size of it. And then we slice it off and regrow it uh, several times in a row. And so it's a new technology that uh, has a clear lineage to the, to the earth and uh, yet at the same time is uh, as pure uh, uh, morally it is, as, as it is but pure. But it's still not cheaper for the end consumer, right? Um, it is uh, a, a little bit uh, less expensive, but uh, um, uh, it is basically priced similarly to the, the spot market that exists in, in the diamond industry, which is very large. You know, it's a very large industry out there. Martin, we thank you for coming in. Thank you for bringing you. the stones for us to see. Martin Rush Eisen joining me there. He is the founder and CEO of Diamond Foundry.